Welcome to another custom mobility how-to video. Warning, when attempting to either manually deploy or stow your ramp, if it requires too much force or effort, or it seems unusually stuck, it may mean there is a problem with the motor. In this situation, it is not advisable to continue deploying the ramp manually, and you will need to call for roadside assistance. Okay, let's get started. If your power fold-out ramp won't automatically deploy for any reason, and you need to enter the van, you may deploy the ramp manually. Start by grabbing the top of the ramp, then bring it out by applying pressure. This does take a bit of effort, but it will deploy. Also, make sure to keep your feet and or wheelchair clear of the ramp as it deploys. Now, if you're stuck in the van and the ramp won't deploy using either the key fob or interior buttons, first, manually open the door. Next, push the ramp out using an open hand, applying steady pressure until it starts to deploy. At a certain point, it should continue its descent on its own. To manually stow the ramp back into the vehicle, grab the side of the ramp first and begin to lift. When the ramp has sufficiently cleared the ground, grab the handle with your other hand and continue lifting using slow, steady pressure. When the ramp is just about vertical, begin to slowly fold it and continue applying pressure, paying attention to the chain and pushing inward until it is back into its proper resting position. A final word of caution. If you must manually close your ramp, your van might remain in the kneeled position. Driving while your vehicle's in this state can be dangerous and may cause damage to your suspension. In this circumstance, it is preferable to call for roadside assistance. Hopefully you found this video useful. Thanks for watching.